All right, what is level two called? Containment area. Uh, I like this level. <laughs> I say that now, but I've never completed it on Ultra Violence Plus. In fact, I've never attempted any episode two mission on Ultra Violence Plus, whether on or off camera. That was kind of funny. I don't know if I mentioned this in one of my previous, in one of my uh, episode one videos, but I, the reason I invited Spaz on to co-commentate with me, I mean, not like he said much, but still he was there. Uh, I, I told him, yeah, come on with me because I, I'm, I'm worried about being able to come at, come up with things to say when I'm alone. But it seemed to be okay. Okay, I'm gonna put away my fist here. All right, I have to remember that I have the plasma cannon. Also, I remember being shocked that you could get the plasma cannon before you got the rocket launcher in this episode. All right. I don't think I want to bother with this, but I know one of these damn boxes can quote unquote open up to reveal a secret. And I'm not sure if I want to fuck with it because they look like boxes. They don't look like they're not walls. I guess they're technically walls if they extend all the way up to the ceiling. All right. Uh, I think I'll go through here first. No, I won't because I don't have the key. Probably be, I should probably be diagonally running so that these videos will take even less time. I wonder if this episode also has an overabundance of shotgun shells. I know that Quake one, which I'll probably do at some point. I've streamed a whole game before. Well, episodes one through the fan made five, but I haven't done anything else with it. I'll probably do it again for the YouTubes. Um, I think that entire game had a, had an overabundance of shotgun shells. And if I can get Quake 2 to run on my computer, I might have to try to find a source port or something. I'll give it a go as well. I'm lining up all these projects when I still have to finish Banjo Kazooie. <laughs> I've been neglecting that project. <laughs> I need to get back to it. But it, it really is like a like a snowball effect or like a momentum kind of thing. Where once you get going, it's easier to keep going. But once you stop for a while. It's hard to get back into it mentally. It's not that I don't have time to do it. It's just, I'm not sure how I want to re-enter it. And that project, the Banjo-Kazooie project is way too old. I either have to scrap it or, or finish it. All right, near the beginning of the level, there is a switch um, that I neglected to flip because I didn't want any... I didn't want gobfuls of monsters bearing down on me, but I think I'm going to go back and pull it. If I can remember where it is. I know it. Okay, it's around here. It's this way somewhere. Hug the walls. I'll find it. Or never mind. Oh, it's this one. Oh, oh, it gave me a shotgun. Nice. Eight shells. I'm glad I came all the way fucking back here for eight shotgun shells. All right. Okay. West is where I came from. I don't have the blue key, so fuck that. Oh, boy. Oh, this will be fun. 
quick save because I can. I don't think the original Doom one had quick saves. I'm not even sure if they had saves at all. But I know Quake one has quick saves. And uh, it also has looking up and down as well as full 3D. The only, of course, the only downside to, oh God, the big downside to Quake 1 is that it's way too easy. Like you can compare Quake 1's nightmare difficulty to this game's like hurt me plenty which is like the middle one oh, I'm glad it auto switches to my shotgun whenever I uh, whenever I pick up four shells that would have done very well for me if I if I was got myself into a fight mm, I'm gonna pick up that yellow key and a bunch of monsters are gonna pop out aren't they Ooh, 24 ammo. This difficulty doesn't give double ammo, does it? Okay, I'm gonna want to go back. I don't know. I, I have no idea how many, how much ammo is supposed to be in each pickup. But four shells when you're picking up the, the uh, a shotgun like the weapon. Sounds about right. And four shells for the uh, for the ammo pickup. So yes, this is definitely not double ammo. All right, I've already been in that one. All right, twenty-eight shells. Let's see what hell this unleashes. Oh, oh don't slip off! Don't slip off! How do I know where to walk, you ask? Well, rewind the video and look at the ceiling. There's like these, these things on the ceiling. They, they guide you to a treasure that they cannot possess. I could sure use an overabundance of shotgun ammo this episode and I have now doubled my ammo capacity oh boy I'm in a corner at least I can still dodge your fireballs and now I'm starting to wish I have a chain gun because I have almost a sixth of my extended bullet capacity because a pistol just ain't gonna cut it and in some places neither is a shotgun but I'm probably not gonna find a place where the shotgun isn't handy until the next perhaps one or two episodes all right starting to get worried about my shotgun ammo oh boy Okay, okay, uh, it would never surprise me if there's a monster closet that ambushes me from the rear. Hmm. And now ever since I got the door closed behind me about an hour ago in this recording session, Ooh, oh, <laughs> double time. Now I'm really wary of that happening again. All right, kid. I thought you had already left. I thought you left because I wasn't streaming uh, GTA four. I have something to say about GTA four. I'll wait till you get back. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and say it here. That is probably like, uh, 
Well, for everything it's worth, I think San Andreas is the best in the series. But... But as far as finding the happy medium between dumbing a game down and bringing it up to speed graphically and everything, I think GTA 4 is the best. GTA 5 really dumb things down. Oh, these are the lost souls, aren't they? No. Oh yeah, these are the first time meeting lost souls. Oh boy, okay. <laughs> Note to self. Okay, so yeah, in the last episode, one of the earlier levels. Oh my god! I falsely thought that there was going to be a closet monster with lost souls in it. But I was mistaken and I should have remembered right then because lost souls don't appear until episode 2, this one. This level. What level am I on now? Two? Yeah, yeah, here's where we start getting to the over 10 minute territory. Hope I didn't go all that way for a medkit just to be crushed. Nah, I'm too fucking fast for it. All right, a wide open area. I don't like this at all. Have I really not picked up a chain gun yet? Gee whiz, I say. Uh, 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 oh, I mean, uh. All right, so I could jump out here. What have I missed back here? I have gone almost everywhere. All right, fast forwarding through this. All righty then. See what's down here. Oh boy, I lost soul and it's a long ass fucking hallway. Okay, that was all for nothing. Let's go back. Fast forward. You know what? I'm not going to fall for the trap. I'm just going to go back. Got to go north and then we'll go east to the blue door. And the red key. All right, where do we find a red door? Wait. Here is another key door, yellow key. So I should have been here a long time ago. Oh, it's sort of a secret, I guess, because there's a backpack here. Oh boy. Three switches. One of them always tells the truth, one of them always lies, and one of them doesn't know what the fuck they're talking about. Ooh, rocket launcher. First rocket launcher. Oh boy. Actually, you can you can turn those without. Oof. Without them being popped up like that. All right, I hope I find a damn chain gun in one of these. Well, I was going to say if my memory served correctly, they it, they do, but apparently not. Hmm. All right, let's find that red door. Although I think if I go all the way around here, I might find another spot that I haven't discovered and it's through here or not. Ah, oh, here. I haven't been. I haven't even been through here yet. Oh boy! At this point, my plasma rifle is gonna fare better than even my shotgun. Wow! So many bullet ammo. I sure hope. Oh, I sure hope I get a, sh a chain gun soon. And there was also a door here. Another yellow key door. And there's a chain gun. 
right, I'm gonna expend about the rest of my plasma rifle, about the rest of my cell ammo on you guys. And then I'm gonna switch to this chain gun. Should I even pick that up? It did fill up my ammo all the way. I think it's only 40 bullets though, so I think I only lost out on one. Oh, I haven't been... I haven't looked at this wall yet. Okay. Just trying to fill in that map information. Alright, so... I don't remember where the hell that red key door was, but... Find it, we're gonna have to go all the way back through here. Okay, okay, where is this damn thing? I probably have to go through the crush. Oh, nope All right, so this makes the thing pop up 12 secrets I'll be here for days All right, well after 17 minutes I'm here. Alright, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in uh, Mission 3. Oh dear. Alright.